the SS Savannah, which navigated the oceans around 200 years ago. But on May the 24th, 1819, history would be made as the Savannah set sail for Liverpool, England, looking to be the first steamship to cross the Atlantic Ocean after 29 and a half nerve-wracking days, which saw the crew overcome several technical issues. The Savannah docked in Liverpool, completing the extraordinary journey, which very few actually thought was possible. Now, in 2016, a man from Long Island named Thomas Schultz claimed to have discovered where the remnants of the Savannah lie. By studying the bay and discovering pieces of washed up wood and metal, Schultz concluded that the Savannah is buried underneath the sand. He has contacted the state about it, but since the bay is federally owned, it's up to the National Park Service to excavate the area, and they have yet to do so. Which would suggest that the the SS Savannah 